Hey guys, so you may hear my pets in the background, you may hear Drew, you probably hear his cartoons and things like that, but I am filming the long-awaited um, baby clothing haul. So this has been requested for ever, like everyone has wanted to see this, and I filmed this before, but I just don't like the way it turns out. It turns out really weird. Um, so I'm doing zero to three and newborn together, just because that's basically what I have out for her to wear in the beginning if she's small then she probably won't fit into zero to three it'd probably like swallow her um so we just kind of have to wait and see but i thought that i would show you guys anyway since i do only have um about three weeks until she's here so i wanted to show you guys some of her clothes now some of these are hand-me-downs like from friends and family that have like little stains on them and stuff which doesn't bother me because honestly she's just gonna puke on them anyway so it's no big deal to me. Um, some of these I've bought, some friends and family have bought, um, just things like that. There's just kind of a variety of who's bought what and where she's gotten it, um, but she does have more than enough. So this is all just onesies. I just thought I would go like segment by segment. Now this is divided into two parts because um, I am getting her stuff together to wash, to get it all washed, and so I have you know, a box or basket full to wash right now, and then there's still some that's put away that still need wash of this. That's why there's two different parts, because I only have some out right now. I really don't want to dig in the in her chest and get everything out and then have to put what I'm not washing as of right now back and things like that. So this is just what I have that I'm about to wash. Um, that way it is clean for her arrival. There's my animals that I was talking about. Anyway, so I thought that I would just go ahead and show you guys her onesies first. Now I do have them separated for the most part. Um, this is newborns and then this is zero to three. So I do kind of have it separated. So the first one is just this long sleeve. This is a newborn Carter's and the only reason I chose to show this first is because there's pants with it and it's like the cutest outfit. I love the detailing on it. Um, it is so, so adorable. Like I can't wait to see her in these clothes because I know I'm going to take so many pictures. And then there's this one, which, oh my goodness, which I love this one just because I love zebras and giraffes. Ignore my nails. I'm actually getting them done too. Okay, Isa. Isa quit. Tomorrow. Um, so there's this one. And that it's something that she needs is long sleeved onesies. That's what I still have to get. Um, not immediately. Like, they can wait. But it is something that she needs. And this one is just plain. Just says cuddly. So then, you know, here's the two different stacks. These are newborn, these are zero to three. I'm gonna go through newborns first, just because they're smaller. Like I said, there is more than this, but they are put away. So there will be a part two. I tried to avoid getting anything like this because it is going to be winter and she, um, I keep it really, really warm in my room, um, but I still don't want her, um, getting sick or cold or anything so I tried to avoid anything short sleeve that you couldn't put underneath a sleeper or anything of that sort so she has a few of these that people bought her and gave to me but there's not very many I also really love birds I think it is so adorable I don't know what my obsession is with birds but it's adorable most of these, like I said, are just plain to go under her sleepers because she literally has like 35 sleepers. Like she has so, oh my god. She has so many sleepers because she is a winter baby. So, there's little ballerinas. This is the zebra pack, I believe, um, from... Child of Mine by Carter's. So this is the Walmart. This is the Walmart line. So you just have the hearts, and then you have the zebra, and then you have the zebra print. Which I'm not really big into zebra print, but it is cute. Little cherries. Like I said, a lot of these are plain. And then this is the um, Gerber set. This was actually on my registry that. Um, a lady who I've gotten actually you know we've talked a few times and she's very frequently active on my Facebook 
got for prim so there's just a little flower and this is like the whole reason I wanted the set because it is so adorable like the foxes oh my goodness and then I really like this one as well because you don't see dark blue for little girls very often so she does have a, have a couple of things in this shade that I love then there's just some flowers and some sheep and the funniest thing is I have this exact one in zero to three as well she is this in newborn and zero to three and then she has a sleeper in newborn and zero to three that's the same one it's it's, it's weird um, and then just some plain ones so she has those and then these are just zero to three ones so I already showed that but we just sitting here so like I said, some of them are stained up, and it, it I, like I said, some of these are hand-me-downs, and I did go through and throw away some that were, like, too stained, um, but little stains don't really bother me, because honestly, she's just going to puke on them, and it's really no big deal. It's a little owl. These are all different brands, that's why I'm not going through them. Her theme is onesies and pink and gray. There's a little mousy. I really like this one as well just because it's so unique. Like you don't ever, ever see anything like this. Now this is actually part of a pack. There is two more to this. Um, but I didn't, I haven't gotten them out of the chest that everything's in yet. Um, but this was actually the first thing that anybody ever bought for Prim, and it was a friend of mine. She got her this, and it's really cute. Like I said, just a lot of plain ones that can go under um, her sleepers for the most part. It's like 80 degrees in here right now. This is the draft line, and I love this. This is so adorable. I wanted to do drafts, but there was not enough draft stuff. Um, so I chose the elephants. But it is so cute. More birds. Like I said, I have an obsession with birds. There's the owls again. And then these ones are just plain to go under sleepers. Little monkey. And this one you guys have actually seen before because this was in a haul. That was for my friend's baby shower. I got this for her daughter. And it's so funny because she gave it back for Prim to wear. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then that is all of the onesies that I have. I was talking I was talking about this and being a newborn in zero to three and then I completely forgot to show it. So this is the zero to three one that I have. Um these are little jackets so this one was another one that I bought for my friend that she ended up just giving back to Prim and so is this these are newborns and then this one is 0 to 3 I believe and this one's so thick guys like you see the material that it is it's super thick it has little ears so it's really really warm it has little pockets it's very soft. It's like um, velvety, or is that? I don't know if that's what it's called. And this is an outfit that I just haven't taken the tags off yet um, to wash. So it's just this little jacket. This is the Carter's line in newborn. Then a, excuse me, um, plain white onesie. And then red pants is actually really cute for Christmas. Might have her wear this on Christmas. I'm not really sure. Um, and then there's a little hood. So like I said, I just still have this in here. Okay, so as for pants, she has a ton, a ton, a ton of pants, but she has like one shirt and the few long sleeve onesies that I showed and a couple more in her chest, which is why she needs long sleeve onesies. Now I'm not going to like jump to the gun and have to go buy them like directly because there is other things that she needs in the beginning, more like diapers and wipes and her bottles and excuse me, things like that. So it's not something that I necessarily have to get because she does have so many sleepers and stuff that it's not something that she has to have um, when she gets here. And Christmas is right on the corner and stuff. So I thought that I would just show this one shirt that she has. I thought about this is, I was trying to show that this is see-through. Um, 
thought about using this for her pictures, but I did find an outfit that I'm going to go buy and do that instead. And then I forgot this long sleeve onesie to show you guys. And then these are all pants. Now I didn't go through these by size because there's so many and they're like 0 to 3 and newborn. That's the only size that is in here, but this size varies so drastically like how big and how little these pants are. Like some of these will literally slip off of her when she's first born, but um, I just put all of her newborn and 0 to 3 together that way just depending on how big she is because right now there's really like no measurement um, but I'm carrying her fairly small so sh I really really think that she's going to be little so anyway like these are just all plain pants like and you'll see the way that the sizes like differ like drastically so yeah these are all just plain for the most part just little leggings Half these probably won't even fit her when she's first born. But she has so many. All different colors. Isa. All different colors. These ones are cute. And so, yeah, she has a ton. And then these are like. She has a ton of pairs of jeggings. I think there's like three or four in here. That's not a ton, but she does have some jeggings. She has some that has a little ruffle butt. These ones I really like with this shirt that I showed. I think it goes really well together. Um, these ones have feet, but they're long. Little jeans. And then this is ruffle butt as well as that. So yeah, she has a ton of pants, but not very many long sleeve onesies or shirts to go with them. Okay, so this is sleepers, but um, I forgot to show this, so that's just a onesie. It's really cute. And then she has two nightgowns, which I want to get so many more nightgowns, but these things are literally like two for like ten bucks. Like, they're so freaking expensive. But I love them so much because they have the mitts to cover the hands, and they gather at the bottom, but they're open. So changing a baby's diaper at nighttime with a nightgown is a breeze. Even though there was a boy, he had nightgowns. And I kept nightgowns on him at nighttime. Because it makes it so easy to change diapers. Like, it's a breeze. So she does have two. She has this heart one and then this zebra print one. And I would love to get so many more, but... Um, hold on. But, um, yeah, they're kind of pricey. So I do have these into two piles as well, newborns and zero to three. Um, okay, so this is the other thing that I was talking about that is a blue that I love. This is one of my favorite clothing items that she has. I actually bought this and it is so, so adorable. Um, I love it so much and this is actually something that I'm going to pack for her hospital bag. Now, Everyone keeps requesting it. I am doing a diaper bag for the hospital and a hospital bag for myself as well. Now my hospital bag won't be packed a few until a few days before my surgery just because um, things that go in it are things that I use every day. So it won't be packed until then. And her diaper bag is going to be packed at any time, but um, there's actually my best friend's mom wants to buy it for me. And she hasn't gotten it yet. Um, so I have to wait until she gets it to pack it. Now it is kind of stressful because I do only have three weeks. Um, but yeah, I don't know. She's supposed to be getting it. So we shall see. So anyway, this is going to be in my dev bag. And you guys will see that. Like I said, some of these are hand-me-downs, whatever. I don't really care. Um, she's just going to wear them for a little bit anyway. Like, as she's older, like, Drew doesn't get hand-me-downs anymore, really. He, I have to buy his clothes in the store and stuff, and that's normally what happens. As newborns, you can buy from garage sales, you can buy from sales sites, you can buy from Craigslist. And it's fine, because they grow out of it. Drew, quit, Bubby. They grow out of it so fast that it's no big deal. Um, no, Drew. But, um, yeah. So, some of these do have small stains, no big deal. Like, it's kind of, like, discolored around the edge, but... She's just going to puke it and discolor it more. But that is also why I avoid white. Um, 
these are all sleepers by the way footed sleepers didn't even say that and this isn't all of them that she has like I said there's still more it's so crazy to say that to see the two stacks that are sitting drew hold on that are sitting here but she does have more so there's just a little ladybug I always fight with myself I know this is a cat but I want to say it's a polar bear like I always fight with myself this is the I have to sleep my floor so bad guys but uh, this is the monkey one that she has in zero to three as well. There's the thirties. This one has a ruffle button. It's really funny because I crave strawberries, so to see strawberry stuff is cute. And then elephant is her theme, so she has a couple of elephant ones. These are all thermal, which means they're very thick and warm, so these will keep her very, very warm. A couple of different polka dot patterns. I really like this one, little sister. Um, she actually has this one matching with my friend who's due the same day as me. Her son has this in white, so they're matching. My friend actually got this because I avoid white because I know it stains easily. Polar bears, I love this one. This is one of my favorites as well. I'm not really sure why. And then just some Aztec. Well, she has one a lot similar to this. And it is zero to three. So that's all the newborn ones she has. And then throw those over there. And bring these right here. So these are zero to three. I keep saying that's all, but it's really not because she has that chest that still has clothes in there. Drittle Bug has a cold. He's sick. So this one is zebra. It has little zebra feetsies. Alright, but that's enough. That's fake. This one's cute. These are the two way zippers from Meyer. So they can um, zipper here and it can go up, you know, to like right here to just high enough to change the diaper and then back down, you know? And then there's one up here too. So that works out great. There's a little bow one. And now and the this one glows in the dark. There's the monkey one that she has in newborn as well. Little flower. This actually goes really well with her um, onesie set that she has. I bet that's like the same line. I mean, it is Gerber, so it is. But more little elephants. I about said monkeys, owls with the ruffle butt. I really like this one. It kind of looks like old lady-ish, but it's cute because it's like floral, you know? More owls. And then these are her zero to three thermals, which are the really, really warm ones. So, there's this one. This one. There's like needs a bath. I really like this one. It's so cute. Candy canes, and then this is matching with my best friend who's due like a week and three days after me. Um, her daughter has this one as well, so they're matching. You okay, Bubby? All right, anyway, so that is all I have, guys. There will be a part two to this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to give a thumbs up if you want to see more, and subscribe if you would like to see more of our story. Um, yeah.